Hey there, welcome. This is Two Wheels Big Life. In our previous episode, we had just arrived at Aspen Park Guest Ranch in Red River, New Mexico. We're going to be spending some time here with our friends Sam and Christy Allen, who are renovating this old resort. In this episode, join us as we show how we're living in a rustic camping cabin. We had just enough time to sample some of the fabulous food, explore the backcountry with a jacked up rental Jeep, wear ourselves out with hiking several of the fantastic trails they have here, and ended our visit with a soak at Ojo Cayente, a hot springs and mud bath resort. There's so many fun things to do in the Red River area, you literally could spend all summer here. Let us show you how we live here. Yep. Come with us. All right. So we stay in a lot of different places. We camp, we tent camp. We also stay in hotels. If Richard has points, so we get free camping there. And here we were blessed to stay at the Allens at Aspen, Aspen Park in one of their cabins that they're not going to tear down, they're going to renovate. And we thought we'd share it with you because it's kind of glorified camping. It is glamping. It is glamping, yes. But it's really, it's really kind of nice. It's really cute. I mean, it's rustic, 60s, salmon colored sinks, <laughs> um, not quite level. No. <laughs> Here's how we use the uh, resting facilities, the facilities. In, in the, inside the cabin. Yeah. We, um, we take a five gallon bucket, fill it up from the single spigot that's right down the road over here uh, from in front of the cabin, fill it up and then we fill up the back tank with it. Another thing we do is that we have a shower facility because this is a guest ranch from back, how far back Chris? The 30s? 30s, yeah. 30s, 30s to the and I think in the 80s it finally shut down, right? Yes. Yeah, it shut down in the 80s, so things kind of run down. But there is a, a, a bathhouse that has a couple showers and a toilet in there that does have running water. Mm -hmm. So that's where we also take our showers, over there. And uh, we'll show you what we're doing over there. We have to manually light the propane water heater with a portable 30-pound propane bottle. Manually light that, let it sit for an hour, and run around, do the do our other stuffs, and then take a shower. And it's nice hot water. It is. It's, it's really hot it, water. It's really good. It's really good, actually. <laughs> Some lunch. Shotgun Willies. Yay. All healthy. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So what is it again, Christy? It's farm fresh, grass fed beef with organic potatoes fried in coconut oil, with hand churned sour cream. Seriously? No, no. I'm lying. <laughs> <laughs> but it's good. Looking for this because our next stop is going to be Silverton. <laughs> it's really cold there. <laughs> well, you got to we well, got to remember what you're going to be using it for too. Layering, layering. Does it make that sparkle? <laughs> Mexicans anymore. But usually we don't go out and go shopping. Shopping. Yeah. I think Richard and I are, are really kind of concerned about Silverado. <laughs> Or Sil Silverton. Silverton. We're concerned about something. <laughs> yes. Silverton is going to be cold. 45 degrees in the morning. Tent camping. Not anymore. I have something warm. Patient for today. Bye bye motorcycles. Hello Jeep. <laughs> <laughs> is that what we're doing? Yeah. <laughs> Just trading one fun toy for another. Let the party begin. Hoo -hoo. Welcome to the back roads of Red River. <laughs> Away we go. You can come. Okay. Where would you guys like to go this afternoon? Do you have any to idea? To the top of the mountain. To the top of the mountain? The old pass the is old what pass. we're doing today. Oh, yeah. is it? So, yeah. the old pass is about a mile down this road here, 578. You'll see a green sign with 488 Sorry. on it. <laughs> Access road 488. You'll make a left onto that road. You'll go up a bunch of switchbacks. Once you get to the top, you have a breathtaking view of lovely upper valley of Red River. Can't go this way. You'll see a dead end sign. That's private property. They might shoot your tires out. Uh, you can go this way though. You'll eventually get to Foster Park. Please turn around once you get there. Fourth of July Canyon is not safe. Do not go past Foster Park. Okay. Uh, don't drive in the meadow. Old Pass. It was a engineering marvel in 1916 and the original way you had to take to get into this town now it's a great trail <laughs> perfect okay have fun guys awesome.
I'm like a kid in the candy store with all of these fantastic hikes that are around the Red River area. I hope you get to enjoy a few with me. Come along. Here we go. Okay. Here she is. This is Brandy, full blood German Shepherd, about eight weeks old. And she is my hiking partner for today. <laughs> it's beautiful. But not that much. Cause if you want somebody else, who am I to judge? I've been thinking about you all the time, but that's all right. I'm starting to get used to it, think I'll survive. I met you in the summer, when you left it was cold. Said we loved one another, guess that we were wrong. I met you in the summer, our love was out of control. I've been going crazy without you. Okay, you're here, and we're gonna go five miles. We're gonna follow Trail 56 to Horseshoe Lake. It's kinda quiet in my room right now without you. And I couldn't really make you stay, so what to do? I'm just staring at my walls and talking to myself now and then I'll try to laugh but I'll cry a bit as well I was never any good at being away from you I met you in the summer Oh, Oh, I, uh, um, hot, hot eyes. Hot, hot eyes? Hot eye. I always thought it was hot waters. No, Ojo is eye. Isn't You're it right. eye in Spanish? I have, we, obviously we, Somebody we, let us know this. <laughs> okay. <laughs>